Hello, my name is Clinton Elmore and this is Marvel City Filmmaker, a video blog for and about the Knoxville, Tennessee filmmaking community. Although the Knoxville Film Festival is a few weeks behind us, we are continuing to bring you coverage. In between events, I had the chance to sit down with Keith McDaniel and talk to him about what it's like to put on a film festival. It's quite different from the old days when my wife and I used to do everything ourselves. We have a, a, a bunch of volunteers that come in. Uh, Dogwood Arts, uh, the, my partner, the organization that's, uh, that uh, we run this together, they have a staff of about six or seven or eight people. You know, putting on a film festival is way more stressful than making a film. You have a deadline, you have certain things you have to do, and you know, you have to count on other folks to do what they're supposed to do, and sometimes that doesn't happen. Like, you know, some of the filmmakers, they won't send me what I need from them by the deadline that I need it, so I have to get on the phone and call them or, or write them an email. Uh, but it, it just progressively gets more stressful the closer you get to the event. Then finally, you get the last week and you're trying to throw everything together to make sure you're ready for opening night. Then once opening night happens, <sighs> You can relax a little bit. Woo, look at my hands. They're way too hot, too, way too hot. Oh, look at the light fall off. How, look at that. Light diminishes the farther away from its source it gets. Obviously, film festivals would be nothing without filmmakers. I had a chance to harass a few during the opening night reception. We're Team Stalker Island Studios, and we have uh, what? and we have uh, an entry this year. The name of the film's called Robin Good, and um, it's a, a eco terrorist ad action Robin adventure. Good. It's hard Who's for me to say it, it's a competitive thing. I know we do compete. Going? But mostly what I'm trying to do is learn how to be a better filmmaker and work with people I care about and have a really good time, which is the only reason to make films is because you love it. Do you want me to stop? <laughs> As a storyteller, I really want people to hear the things and see the things that I have to say. And this is a great forum. Keith McDaniel's been so integral in my development as a filmmaker because of this festival. And I really appreciate this, uh, this event. It's just become such a great time for artists to come together. So if you're not watching films with all of us cool nerdy people, then you're really on the out. 